Damn, dude, 25 points away from my GI unit. So many tags. There it is, boys. Finally. All right, GI, get in here before the game's done. I'm skipping tags. I'm going for kills. At least that is, is this thing for real? Is this for real? I'm going to kill myself right now. Don't say that. For Don't real. say and this is you. Did I, did I, I don't know what to do with myself. I have no clue. <laughs> did you just take my day? Everything. Is this you for real? And this is you that I was sick, dude. Damn. Damn. Yo, what's up, dude? It is me. It's me, I promise. Oh, you join the party chat as soon as you. Oh my god! Tell me! Oh my lord. Yo, what's up, ladies and gents? My name's Sean, aka Elite uh, Shot, and today I'm sharing with you what I think to be the best assault rifle in Black Ops 3. Check this out, folks. The gun I'm talking about is the KN44. That's right, yo. Now, when I call this the best AR, I'm speaking about public games, public matches, not competitive. If we were playing competitive, then I'd probably say... The M8A7 simply because it's more of a precise, accurate weapon that's designed for just one burst in people. So, if I had to pick the two best assault rifles in this game, I'd say the M8A7 and the KM44. Now, I understand everyone has their own preference, their own opinion, what they think to be the best, and good, follow that. Use what you think is the best weapon in your hands. Don't use the KN or the M8 just because I think they're the best. Use what you play best with. Now, I still want to consider the ICR-1 my favorite AR, simply because I like how accurate it is and I'm very consistent with it. Though, if we're speaking in terms of best of the best, then I'd think the KM44 is in one of the top spots. The reason I think this is because it has very high damage, it drops super quickly, it's consistent, the recoil is very manageable, has a very good rate of fire, and combined with this setup, you are almost unstoppable. Check this out, guys. The quick draw, the grip, rapid fire, and fast mags. It is so deadly, my enemies don't stand a chance. For my perks, I use flat jacket, scavenger, and tech mask because I like staying alive. Do not like dying by explosives, getting more ammo, of course, and I don't want to get affected by any of that baloney. I mean, if you're playing competitive, then it might be a different story. You might want to rock like Afterburner and like Blast Suppressor. It's all your choice and you can pick what you play best with, but this setup right here, guys, is one of my best setups in Black Ops 3. Try this out and let me know what you think. If you guys enjoyed this gameplay, smash that thumbs up button and like always, sit back, relax, and enjoy the gameplay. Bum bum dee dum bum 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 dee dum bum 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 bum
All right, this game did not start too long ago, so let's get right into the action and start dominating my enemies with my KM44. They ain't ready for this gun, guys. I'm telling you, this thing is so powerful, so strong. You do not want to mess with it. I mean, as you can clearly tell already, we're just walking through. Walking through, bros. This gun is too strong. It reminds me of the AN-94. Probably why it has a similar name. Now, of course, from close up, SMGs like the VMP will beat me out. So when I do use this, I want to make sure I'm aiming down sight and firing away. Oh my god, dude. I mean, it's... It's sickening how good it is. Enemies, no more shoot me in the back aloud. I pro I prohibit you from doing that. What the heck? What are you doing? I actually probably sh I probably should have let him cap it so I could have got points too. I gotta start listening more because I don't got amplify and I'm too busy freaking talking. I can't hear him behind me. That's one down. No, we're not losing B. I'm really trying to push for these kills fast, which is getting me killed. Normally, I prefer to play more strategically, but with this kind of gun in my hands, I just feel so confident in gunfights, and I feel a lot more comfortable being able to rush for the kills. These back shots, bro. They, they gotta go. Rushing for kills is a good way to get kills quickly, but it's also a great way to die just as fast. So, let's play a little smarter. Hell no, bro. Hell no. Hell no, bro. Securing A. Come here, buddy. Why are you behind me? Need more. Damn, dude. No freaking chill whatsoever. Absolutely none. We probably should cap B, bros. Oh, we're being dominated. Uh-oh. That's never a good sign. Thank you. Stay alive, stay alive, stay alive, stay alive, stay alive, stay alive. Stay alive. I'm calling it in. I know the round's almost done, but I need some backup. Pronto. There we go. There we go. There we go, baby. They took it out already? Literally just got it. It's already took taken out. Well, damn. I'm going to save these for the next round. the health back go ahead I'm staying calm staying cool staying collected Steal yourself. Another round coming up. all right I'm playing a lot more strategic now I mean it's so easy to get in the habit of rushing rushing and rushing and rushing and rushing it, it might work out for a little bit but in my experience after a while it just starts to, to go go bad and dying and dying and dying not a big fan of dying bro like this thing is so powerful all right not too bad for the first round I definitely died a lot more than I wanted to but if you get a shot in the back you can't prevent it I don't got eyes behind my head bro that's why you want to be extra aware of your surroundings and when you push up, you want to make sure you're in the better in the in the upper hand. You have the advantage. Some people prefer to rush. Some people prefer to camp. I prefer. I don't want to say a combination of both because I don't like camping. But sometimes you have to stand still. And standing still, defending a point, is not necessarily camping. Picking a corner spot and sitting there the whole game. Now that's that's camping or resorting to the same spot over and over again. Oh, they're in for it, dudes. I am missing. 
Ooh, there we go. There we go. <gasps> no! 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 Not down by Cerberus. No way. No, Cerberus! Get out of here, dude. All right, boys, let's get a lot more streaks. All right. I need lots and lots more. Kills are what keep me satisfied. Oh, damn. Okay. Okay. They're going to spawn over there. Where you at, enemies? Woo! Nice shot. I'm surprised no one has... Oh, we got B now. Hostile Wraith? That is not good, folks. That Wraith's gonna cause problems. Oh, no. Go get him. Go get him. I just want that Wraith to go away. Just go away, Wraith. Alright, get it quick. Get this quick, boys. Quick. Quickity quick. Hurry up. Some more. Dude. When I die by a good death, I'm, I say good job. When it's a BS death, no. But then again, when is any death a good death? It's ever like, cool! Brave step. Dude, I, I'm just gonna control this. Stay, stay mobile. Always get ready to shoot. We're good still. We're good. Go back to B to defend it. I kind of want to control my Talon, but... It just blew up. Seriously, Talon, you can't survive one freaking grenade. You can't survive one grenade. You probably cost like a million dollars to produce and you die by one little grenade. Okay, they got to make that a little more strong, bro. That's not... That's not right. Okay, 7 to 3 and 15, my first game with the KM44, and we went completely off. Although I had more deaths than I would like, check it out. We got 22 defense, 5 caps. I mean, dude, I think I might switch the town because that thing was a piece of garbage. I thought it was going to help me more. It did not help me that much at all. The KM44 is the gun I use when I want to try hard. Like, I'm, it's no mercy, dude. I can use some other gun to have fun with, but the KM44 is the gun to use when you completely want to dominate your enemies. No mercy. They ain't tapping out. Nope. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay. If you did, smash that thumbs up button. Thank you so much. In the comment section, let me know. What do you think is the best Asara from the game, or which one do you play the best with? Definitely try this class out and see what you think, because it completely obliterates the Cam 44 is too good. Seriously, it melts. Yo dudes, before you go, check out my description for all of my social media links. Stay connected and hit me up on all social media, bros. And check out my gaming essentials, the things I use to improve my game. Don't want to miss out. Anyways, my fellow gamers, my name's Sean, aka Elite Shot. I'm your friendly COD fanboy, and I'm signed out.
Peace. Stay elite.